What's going on guys, Crow here and welcome to this pretty awesome Battlefield Bad Company 2 gameplay. Um, and this, this quad, we became best friends in this game. I mean, look at this. From the beginning, right from the beginning, just look. I believe I can fly and get a war kill. What the fuck? <laughs> you know, uh, that, was, uh, that was pretty interesting. So, we became best friends during this game. And then, unfortunately, like in some cheesy movie, we had to part ways. But enjoy the gameplay, and if you did, of course, leave a thumbs up. It only takes a second, and that would be amazing. Um, leave you guys' comments as well, because this is going to be a tough thing to discuss. Battlefield Hardline or Omaha or whatever has been leaked all over. All over! There's a trailer, there's an official like gameplay shit. So, my thoughts on it. And before I actually uh, move on, I want you guys to tell me your honest, like, thoughts. No fanboy bullshit, just honest opinions. If you're a fanboy of the franchise or whatever, I don't think that this video is for you. But even though, uh, you should give me your honest opinions, you know, on the matter. And for everybody else that gaming is just gaming and, you know, you, you game to have fun and you look at different perspectives and whatnot. So tell me your guys' opinion in the comment section below in regards to Battlefield Hardline, Battlefield, Omaha, whatever. If you haven't seen the trailer, I don't really want to link it because I'm scared of, like, copyright shit. So just look it up, uh, go on Twitter, type in Omaha trailer or something like that and it's definitely going to uh, appear and you can watch it. Um... Well, let's get first things out of the way. It looks exactly like Battlefield 4. It looks at from the textures to the animations to the weapons to the character models. It looks Battlefield 4 as fuck. Supposedly, it has been in development alongside Battlefield 4, so whatever. Um, with the awful, awful launch that Battlefield 4 had, I thought through and through that this is going to be a DLC or free to play or whatever since the moment it has been announced as Hardline. I didn't even consider it being full price, like at all. I figured that it would be, you know, guys, we messed up with the Battlefield 4 launch. Um, uh, we messed up with the Battlefield 4 launch, so here's a free-to-play, uh, awesome DLC with fucking heists and all that stuff, and just enjoy it as a way of, you know, thank you for sticking with us. But nope, or, or maybe even like for five dollars or something. But this is going to be a standalone title. This is going to be sixty-five dollars, supposedly. What the fuck? <laughs> That's not good. But whatever. Um, another thing that under the trailer there was a lot of negative comments from the hardcore Battlefield community. Um, everybody was getting their hopes up because it was supposed to be Bad Company 3. I mean, it's Bad Company 3 time. The entire Battlefield community loves this game. I mean, I maybe know like one person that didn't get into it. I even got into it. I even got into Bad Company 2. This game is fucking badass. Everybody's playing Battlefield 4, Battlefield 3, and I'm over here freaking playing Bad Company 2. And the servers are almost full. Every game that I joined today, it's full. So, this game is still alive So on the PS3, so go enjoy it. It's, it's awesome. Go back to it. It's pretty sweet. If you're fed up with Battlefield 4, go to Bad Company 2. You're gonna have a lot of fun, just like I had today. Uh, so as you guys see, I'm taking my quad everywhere. From one objective to another, from one cover to another. And this is going to be a resting place. Oh, how I... How I'm gonna miss my quad. Look at this. Uh, we're going for the objective for objective A, so everything seems fine. But going back to the trailer. I mean, I'm not gonna say that the whole... Zip lining thing, that the heists, whatever. That it, that it doesn't look cool. I mean, it's payday battlefield or, or something or other. Or bank heists and... and I don't know. I, I mean... Shit. GTA 5 Payday and Battlefield Heist Omaha Delta Force comes into play, but um, I just don't know how to feel about it. I, I really, if it really is $65, then I will be pissed off because Battlefield fans, hardcore Battlefield fans, deserve that shit for free. Deserve it for free for everybody that bought the DLC for Battlefield 4, for everybody that had issues with that game. They deserve that for like at least maybe for free or for like five bucks. This should have been a DLC. It's not. Uh, it's going to be a standalone title. It should have been free to play or whatever. It's most likely not. Uh, so I don't know. Uh, just from the graphical point of view, it looks exactly like Battlefield 4. I mean, there is absolutely no difference. And look at this. I took these. I take these two guys out. I go to my quad, and unfortunately, 
my quad dies. So rest in peace, awesome quad, and then I die as well. Paying homage to my quad. Alright, so... Uh, another thing that people get pissy about is comparing this game to Call of Duty. Um, but how can you not compare it to Call of Duty where when EA used to take two years to develop a Battlefield game? Uh, maybe a little bit more even, because from Battlefield 2 to Battlefield 3, a few years passed. And then Battlefield 4 came out a little bit sooner than everybody expected, but alright. And then we're gonna get this yearly fix of Battlefield and without really changing anything. I mean, a new setting is fine and all, but is it is it gonna be enough? I thought, I swear to God, I swear to you guys, I thought that this was going to be like a I'm sorry gift from EA. I swear to God, from when the moment when the leak came out, when I saw the BFH on on like a, for PS4 and Xbox One, I thought this was going to be like a, I'm sorry DLC because of the whole mishap with the launch. And it's it's not, it's not. I mean, some of the cool things that I liked about it, yeah, the police chases are cool. Maybe the heists are going to be cool. But I have a lot of mixed feelings about this game. I'm not going to get hyped for it at all. Is, if this is going to turn into Battlefield 4 comes out, then some other filler, then Battlefield 5, then some other filler, just like Call of Duty. I mean, since Call of Duty 4, we've been on the cycle of using the same engine, using the same everything, just reskinning it, and boom, push it out, and people still go still going to buy it. People are going to buy this game, uh, the Battlefield um, Hardline. People are going to buy it. Um, but if they're, whether they're gonna like it, that's to be determined by, you know, by the sales numbers. Um, I don't know how to approach this game, to be quite honest. I am very skeptical about this title. Uh, I'm wor worried about the direction that Battlefield is heading in. Uh, so, if this is supposed to be like a working version of Battlefield 4 or whatever, why not just stop and... I don't know. I mean, you guys tell me. You guys are fans of the series as well, you guys tell me. I would really like for Battlefield Bad Company 3 to come out. And I'm at a loss for words, I don't know what to say. I mean, holy shit, I gave you my opinions, I think it looks... It's just Battlefield 4 DLC for $65, if that's the case. I mean, if, if heists satisfy you and you can justify it being $65 for a zipline and a heist, then I don't fucking know, man. But, I mean, I would love Battlefield Bad Company 3 to come out. This is Battlefield. And one of my Twitter followers said that, yeah, the, you can't get away, the purse snatcher can't get away when you have a fucking 810 Warthog chasing after him, so that was quite funny. But yeah, I don't know, guys, I, I'm, I'm in the middle, I don't know what to say about this game, to be quite honest. Uh, we'll see. When it comes out, it's most likely going to come out this fall, definitely is going to come out this fall, or maybe even earlier, I don't know. But tell me you guys' opinions about Battlefield Hardline, um, Omaha whatever uh, in the comment section below be sure to leave a like and I will see you guys next time